Hi, this is Jay Croucher, head trader at PointsBet with Open Book. Today we're going to start with some wins for the people from the past week or two. And so I'm going to tell you about the St. Louis Cardinals, who've just reeled off an 11-game win streak, led by Tyler O'Neill, Paul Goldschmidt, and cult icon Jay Happ. In winning these 11 games, the Cardinals have likely locked up the second wildcard spot at the expense of the San Diego Padres and Fernando Tatis Jr.'s MVP candidacy. In those 11 games, the Cardinals are actually underdogs in eight of them, so betters feasted on the higher odds. And now, the biggest win for the book for the past week, which was the Kansas City Chiefs failing to cover three and a half against the Baltimore Ravens on Sunday Night Football. People are just terrified of backing against Patrick Mahomes, but they might have been well to do so the past 12 games because Kansas City have only covered once in their past 12 games against the spread. And this week, we see the lack of respect starting to kick in a bit with the Chiefs only favoured by six and a half points at home to the Chargers. So here's what we have to look forward to the next few days. We have the Ryder Cup in Whistling Straits, Wisconsin, home to fierce winds and squeaky cheese curds, and we make the US a heavy minus 190 favorite to win the Ryder Cup over the Europeans, despite the fact that the US have lost seven of the past nine Ryder Cups. Then early Saturday morning, we have Chelsea against Manchester City in the biggest game to date of the English Premier League season. This is a rematch of the Champions League final where City were heavy favorites and then lost. This time around, with Chelsea at home at Stamford Bridge, we see this game as dead even, where it's plus 165 for either team to win and plus 220 the draw.